Good afternoon. This is Kelsey Ruff Smith, Director of Programs here at the Community Foundation for Ocala Marion County, Florida. And joining me today is Christina Donahue, the Regional Director for the American Heart Association in Marion County. Hi, Christina. How are you today? I'm doing well, Kelsey. Thanks so much for having me today. Yes, we are so happy to have you here. Now, the American Heart Association is really a household name. It's been around for a very long time. Uh, but for those who might not be familiar, can you tell us a little bit about not your nonprofit, what you do, who you serve, what needs you fill? Yes, absolutely. Thank you so much. I'm very proud to represent Marion County uh, today as part of the American Heart Association. So the American Heart Association for 400 years has been uh, leading the way in finding life-saving research and data that will help people suffering from cardiovascular disease. That's great. And I'm sure we have a lot of people here in Marion County who can benefit from the services that you all offer in the scope of that. Um, but with coronavirus, I know that that's really impacted every nonprofit in our community. Can you explain some of the big challenges that you are experiencing right now with your organization? Sure, our organization is, is seeing a decline um, as, you know, as part of the COVID response. We're seeing a decline in people reporting going to the hospitals. That's a concern for us because 120 million Americans uh, prior to COVID suffer from some sort of cardiovascular disease. It is the number one killer among you know, men and women. So we have been uh, relentless uh, over the years in our, in our mission, which is to increase the life expectancy and the quality of life for all Americans. Um, so when we do hear that uh, through our hospital our, excuse me, partners, that we're seeing these declines in hospital visits, that sends a red flag. So we are working at uh, meeting people where they are through social initiatives or social media, working with our hospitals to remind people that hospitals are still safe um, and that if they do have any kind of uh, health issue, to call 911 because again, we, we wanna make sure people are getting the, the care that they need. Um, in addition, you know, we do realize that the pe very patients that we serve, and we serve, you know, children with congenital heart disease to, uh, you know, our senior population um, and, and folks in between who have, you know, hypertension. These, these very patients are the ones that are being uh, greatly impacted by COVID. So we are committed to being part of the solution to help these patients. Um, but again, every day we're, we're learning something new. It is a living case study, as you know. Mm -hmm. um, certainly. And those are serious, some hardships, especially with people not reporting, um, you know, that they are having heart attacks or strokes right now. So uh, with all of that kind of darkness overhanging right now, what are you able to find you're most proud of through all of this? Well, like so many, um, you know, people across the country and really right here locally in Marion County, it's been amazing to watch how creative, um, you know, us as an organization has had to become, um, you know, in our approach. Um, but really, we have been a part of this solution. Uh, you know, the very population that we serve, uh, you know, Again, we our volunteers, we have over 33 million volunteers across the nation that help us. Um, these very volunteers, excuse me, volunteers, many of them are, you know, on the front lines uh, in our hospitals. They are mm -hmm. cardiologists. They are hospital administrators. They are nursing staff. Um, so we are working to try to uh, focus on keeping them safe. We are advocating um, so that they have uh, the PPE that they need. We are also fast tracking $2.5 million um, to fund rapid uh, response research. So we're using our research dollars, dollars that our local uh, donors, especially here in Marion County, um, are part of the solution of finding out how we can help uh, COVID. That's amazing. Um, so people who want to help you right now, what are the best ways that they can do that? Or who is it that can help you today? So sure, we are uh, now more than ever uh, leveraging and focusing on co continuing to collaborate with our community partners. We are certainly sensitive to what is happening uh, to a lot of our community uh, partners and individuals and donors, uh, particularly on the financial front. We want to be a resource. We have tons of wonderful information um, you know, about how to stay healthy 
ways to keep your children entertained and healthy. So um, people can reach out to me directly at christina.donahue at heart.org. Um, but also um, we are looking to continue uh, you know, getting support uh, to help fund our mission. We don't want to shy away that we do need to continue to help uh, you know, the 120 million Americans. Uh, we want to reduce that number of people suffering from a cardiovascular disease. So this Tuesday is Giving Tuesday, and we are asking um, our local community, Marion County, to uh, text 71777, and the keyword is AHA Marion, and contact me, and we'd love to have your support. That's so great. Um, so you've just given us that text number as a way people can contact you. Uh, just one more time, the best ways for people to contact you so they have their pens and papers ready. Okay, sure. They can contact me at Christina, that's with a K, K-R-I-S-T-I-N-A dot Donahue, D-O-N-O-H-U-E at heart.org. Um, and then also, again, Giving Tuesday, you can text 71777. Uh, the keyword is AHA Marion. And again, um, if there is an organization or an individual uh, that needs more information that they'd like to get out to their staff, their employees, their congregation, we, uh, we have so many resources and I'd be more than happy to send some of those as well. That's so great. Thank you, Christina. Is there anything else you want to share before we disconnect today? No, I just want to say how proud I am of our community. Um, we have a tremendous, uh, tremendous amount of support. And now more than ever, as an organization, we want to make sure that we're there. Um, and we're continuing our mission to make Marion County the healthiest county it can be. Uh, we've got a lot of work to do. And we're looking forward to the next coming months. Thank you. I really appreciate you and all the hard work you're doing. Take care and be safe, OK? Thank you. Thanks, Kelsey. Yeah, no problem. Bye. Bye.